Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do something very very exciting. We're gonna try some of the Prime drinks. I mean I've heard so much good about these drinks and I'm so excited to try them and unfortunately I wasn't able to get all of them but these are the four and we got the ice pop, we got the lemon lime, we got the tropical punch and we got the blue raspberry very very interesting and in the end of this video i will also tell you guys my prediction of the prime card so that's going to be very interesting but first of all i'm going to rank these four which i think is the best and which i think is the first so this is going to be very exciting yeah okay so let's go i thought let's start with the ice pop it's a little bit because it does have the blue and the red in, so it looks like a little bit of a mix, but who knows. Um, let's give this a try. It smells quite interesting. It smells like lemonade. It tastes similar to something else that I've tasted before. It tastes like the cherry, you know, the cherry candy. That's how I found this one tastes like. Mm, very much like the cherry candy. This is quite interesting, but quite yummy actually. Mm. Okay, let's try the lemon and lime. I am actually a huge fan of lemon and lime. I love the sprites and I love a lot of the Schweppes that are the lemon and lime. So I want to see if this one stands out for it or if it is maybe a new upgrade to the lemon and lime different drinks oh yeah it definitely smells a lot of like the citrusy fruit it is yummy but I feel like it is a little bit too soury for my taste, but it is definitely yum. I love it. Okay, you guys, let's continue with our third contestant here, which is the Tropical Punch. And I have a feeling that this one is going to be very exotic. Mmm, it smells very exotic. It's, it smells a little bit similar to the Ice Pop. I don't know why. Hmm. To be fair, I usually love the red ones, but I am a little bit unsure about this one, to be honest. Uh, let's try the last one, and then I will tell you guys what I think about every one of them. And this is, of course, the blue raspberry. Here we go. Mm-hmm. I found this was quite yum as well but of all of them I found that the blue raspberry has the least taste and the least flavor out of them and the strongest one is probably one of these two and I found these two quite similar okay you guys so to my result of my my own little review I want to say that the blue one unfortunately get the fourth place of the reason that it doesn't have that much flavor to be honest these three had way more flavor than the blue one like way more it was very plain in the taste and yeah i probably would never buy that one again to be fair it is not nah, these three was way better uh the second or the third that earns the third place here will be the red one which made me quite surprised because I love red stuff. I love red treats. I love red drinks. Like everything that's red is usually my favorite, but unfortunately not this one. Maybe because all of them has the coconut water and I am not a huge fan of coconut. That was bringing me quite strongly into the drink. Um, so unfortunately that one will earn a third place. And then we got the two contestants over here that is still in the game. And I am gonna do Ta -da! of the reason that 
I am a fan of lemon and lime. And this one actually tasted really strong of like the citrus fruits, which was quite interesting. Uh, and it was quite different to the rest of the three. So yeah, this is definitely something I could think about buying once again. Um, this one was quite similar in taste to the red one I found. But yeah, hmm. Very, very interesting to try them. I've seen them everywhere and I have just been so excited to give them a try. But unfortunately, I haven't been able to buy them before because we have here in Sweden, we haven't really had them for that long. So I am quite excited that we finally been able to buy them all or like at least these four here. So I'm really looking forward to see if I can find the other ones and actually give them a try as well. But yeah, this is my ranking of these four bottles. So yeah. There we go, you guys, like definitely a winner when I'm going to enjoy this one tonight, to be honest. Like I'm going to save these ones and probably finish them off anyway, but I have to say favorite, favorite, mm, favorite. And I love the color too. It is a really pretty, pretty green and I love it. And anyway, let's continue and get to my prediction of the prank. Okay, before we start this, I just want you to keep in mind that these are just my predictions for some of the exciting fights on the Prime Card. Slim versus Soul Puppy. And I think the fight between Slim and Soul Puppy is going to be an interesting one. Slim has been in the game for a while now and he's used to the weight class. Soul Puppy, on the other hand, might be facing a bit of a challenge adjusting to this weight. My prediction? Slim takes the win in this bout. King Kenny versus Anthony Taylor. King Kenny has shown tremendous growth and improvement in this last few bouts. And I believe he's going to continue that trend in this fight. Even though Anthony Taylor is an experienced fighter, I think King Kenny recently performances had demonstrated that he is ready to take on the challenge and make a statement in this bout. Logan Paul versus Dylan Dennis. Now, the highly anticipated Logan Paul versus Dylan Dennis bout. Dylan may be a jiu-jitsu master, but when it comes to boxing, I'm predicting Logan Paul to secure the win. It's a whole different game in the boxing ring, and Logan has shown his ability in previous fights. KSI versus Tommy Fury. Last but not least, KSI is taking on Tommy Fury. The odds may be stacked against KSI, but I've got a feeling he's going to rise to the occasion. He has proven himself in the ring before, and I think he will continue to impress. My prediction is that KSI takes the fight. Well, there you have it, folks. Some of my predictions for the Prime card. Remember, these are just my predictions. And the beauty of combat sport is that anything can happen on a fight night. So make sure to tune in, enjoy the action, and let's see how it all unfolds. But don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our coverage. So you guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you up in the next video. Bye-bye!